In this video, we are going to discuss B spline. In the previous videos, we, are, we were discussing that how to draw a complex long curve and how to minimize the respective complexities and also how to check that how far the curves are continuous and smooth at the joining point. So, in this particular video, we are going to discuss only the B spline and its respective parametric equations. So, a B spline is a parametric curve composed of a linear combination of basis B splines and these curves will be represented as B i n and here we are having P i where i is ranging from 0 to m all these P i all these points will be known as control points. So, here we are considering multiple number of control points to draw the curve where P t is equal to sigma i is equal to 0 to m P i B i k t. Here we are having this knots. So, t 0 is less than equal to t 1 is less than equal to dot 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 is less than equal to t k plus m. So, subdivide the domain of the B spline curve into a set of knot spans. So, the spans will be ranging t i 2 t i plus 1. So, in this way we are having multiple knots here and if you can increase this particular knots then you are going for more detailing about the curve. So, the B spline can be defined using this respective equation. So, here you can find that B i 1 t is equal to 1 if t is ranging in between t i 2 t i plus 1 otherwise 0. So, this is the respective equation for this B spline curve. So, in this way we have just given you the idea of how to represent B spline curves using parametric equations. Thanks for watching this video.